I want to ask you some more details about therapeutic ketogenic diets, such as those that, that you and others have used um, in, in this area of research. So there's many different ketogenic diets one could eat. And what I mean by that is, you know, the fatty acid profile of your ketogenic diet could be very different from someone else's. You might be having high saturated fat, high polyunsaturated fat, monounsaturated, uh, all the different combinations thereof. We mentioned earlier that polyunsaturated fatty acids, they can be oxidized readily by reactive oxygen species. And this produces toxic, uh, byproducts, reactive aldehydes and things like this that damage cell components. And we, we, know, we alluded to some other work that's been done related to that stuff. When you guys use a therapeutic ketogenic diet, what are the specific fatty acid profiles that you use? And what's important to think about here in terms of fatty acid composition from saturated to more unsaturated fats? Well, the this, this saturated fats, uh, medium chain triglycerides are, are more provocative for bu bu building nice uh, ketone bodies than polyunsaturated fatty acids. Polyunsaturated fatty acids can give uh, flexibility to membranes like olive oils and things like this. I mean, there's, there's a number of polyunsaturated fatty acids that are very fish oils and things like this uh, that are very healthy for you. Um, but to make ketones, and the answer is uh, we, we, use, we use mono... Um, medium chain triglycerides, avocados. We try to get, we try to do it with as much natural uh, fatty acids a, as possible, always calorie restricting them, always using the glucose ketone index, which is the ratio of circulating ketones to glucose as kind of a guide. Uh, so um, people say, we use the GKI more uh, to know what zone you're in uh, as opposed to the types of fatty acids that you are consuming. But we, but we know there are natural ways to get ketones, ketogenesis, natural ketosis. Uh, you're mobilizing the fats predominantly out of your uh, uh, adipocytes. But at the same time, if you take in a diet with medium chain triglycerides, whether it comes from a plant or an animal, uh, you'll get, you'll produce better uh, all natural ketone bodies. And again, it should be done under low glucose because the lower the glucose, the more the need for the body to make ketones uh, from the liver. So um, 